Are you ready over there? Okay, yep. with me? Yep. Okay, settle. And we get speed. Speed. And action. Hi, my name is Thomas Wold, and I'm a furniture builder, and I do the solid wold column for Ready Made Magazine. Today we're going to build a project by Andrea Keller, and I'm going to show you how to make it. This project is called Box Seats, and what's interesting about it is if you have a small living space, it's both artwork and seating. The tools you'll need for this project are a ruler, pencil, table saw, packing tape nail gun, power drill, router, sander, a level. So I prepared a full-scale mock-up of the stool we're going to make and I find this really helpful just to help determine angles of things and proportion and you can actually just set it and take a look and see if it looks like the right size. So this one looked like it was going to work out so let's build this one. First thing that we're going to do is just make one of the boxes for the project. So I have some scrap over here and it's just enough material to show you how to make the basic box for the project. This is actually just um, a scrap of some pre-finished uh, cherry plywood. We're going to rough cut this material down and then I'm going to show you how to cut the miters in a second. So we've got all the pieces cut and we're going to go and put them together. So here's the mitered parts and basically what we're going to do is just we're going to fold everything just like a box that's hinged. It's going to um, be pretty simple to do. Um, let's set it up. You just want to line up these corners pretty good and you let the tape pull it tight. So I push one edge down pretty firmly and just hold it and give it a little tug. It's really pulling it together now, and we just repeat that all the way around the box. So we've got the box all taped up, and the tricky part is to flip it over so we can uh, glue it up. Let's flip it. That's it, let's add some glue. So now we're going to put some glue on the piece, and the key with doing that is uh, it's just not to put too much. That's about right. All right, let's fold this up. So we want to tape these corners too, like we did the top. And then pull that around. So that looks pretty good. I think we just want to massage the corners a little bit. So our box is all taped up and we're going to let it dry for a couple hours. So let's, uh, let's go outside. Oh